Jasmine Pineda from 90 Day Fiancé Season, 10 Likes to Deceive Her Beau, Gino Palazzolo, and Her Fans. Here are some examples of her worst lies ever. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching for more details. Jasmine Pineda has slowly proved she's one of the biggest liars in the 90 Day Fianti franchise. The 36-year-old single mother debuted on the series in 2021. She joined 90 Day Fianza. Before the 90 Day season, five alongside her Michigan-based boyfriend, Gino Palazzolo. At the start, Jasmine seemed like a genuine woman with a few insecurities and anger issues. However, she showed her real self when she returned to the series in 2023 and began manipulating Gino into doing things for her. She also made a mockery of her sex life by sharing too much information in front of the cameras. Jasmine faced many challenges with Gino over the course of three years. One such situation transpired in 90 Day Fianza. Before the 90 Days Season 6, which eventually led to Gino breaking up with her. The circumstance made Jasmine realize her fault and beg Gino to take her back. Luckily for her, he gave her another chance. In 90 Day Fianza Season 10, Jasmine and Gino returned to showcase their K-1 visa journey. They planned to marry in 90 days while juggling personal differences and wedding plans. Once again, the pair argued about the smallest things, most of which were Jasmine's faults. Jasmine does seem like a great mother to her sons and a good sister to her siblings. However, she is an atrocious partner who likes to manipulate situations by lying. Jasmine was accused of deception in early 2022. At the time, she had made a claim that Gino had indirectly got her fired by sending her private pictures to his ex. Jasmine made Gino feel bad for her and pushed him to do things for her. Another time viewers accused Jasmine of lying was when she claimed she lost the engagement ring Gino gave her. A few years ago, the Panamanian reality TV star was excited about how her American boyfriend proposed and gave her a ring. However, she later revealed that she had conveniently lost the same ring right after Gino didn't get her a new one as he had promised. Even Gino claimed that he was sure Jasmine was lying about the whole thing to push him to get her a more expensive upgraded ring. However, Jasmine denied the accusation and threw a fit. Jasmine likes to gain an advantage in every situation. She can't accept it when things don't go her way and blows up about the smallest things. In 2023, the couple had an unexpected argument when Gino claimed that Jasmine was just as important to him as his family. Jasmine got angry because he didn't consider her superior and started screaming. At one point, she loudly uttered, you wanna see a video of me fucking Dane? She claimed she filmed the video a month before but backtracked on this statement later. Jasmine admitted there was no sex tape, and she simply said it to hurt Gino. Apart from lying on Gino's face, Jasmine has deceived him by not telling him the complete truth. In 90 Day Fianza Season 10, she shared how she used the allowance Gino gave her for her wedding gown and wasted it on getting cosmetic surgery. She revealed she used it to get butt implants and seemed confident about her choice. Jasmine didn't tell Gino about misusing his money on her cosmetic procedure. Instead, she acted self-righteous about the whole thing and made it seem like it was an absolute necessity. She said, I was basically forced to spend the money, stating it was all because of Gino's cheapness. Jasmine's butt lift fly had another big lie tied to it. Not only did she spend Gino's hard-earned money on cosmetic surgery, but she somehow encouraged her ex-boyfriend, Dane, to pay $2,000 towards it. Jasmine hid the truth from Gino for the longest time in 90 Day Fiancé Season 10. However, the bigger issue was how she even made her former lover contribute towards her surgery. Jasmine gave no real answers to her lies. 
she may have had to provide Dane with something in return for his favor, which alludes to infidelity. Jasmine may have cheated on Gino behind his back. The butt lift situation wasn't the only time Jasmine did something behind Gino's back. Back in 2021, she didn't tell Gino about taking birth control pills, knowing that he wanted to start a family with her. While Jasmine was right for not wanting to have kids right away before her marriage, she was wrong for not being transparent with her beau. She was likely scared he'd leave her if she told him she wouldn't give him children. Therefore, she lied to keep the relationship going until she got complete control over him. Jasmine has misused Gino's money on too many occasions. However, the worst moment was when she returned to 90 Day Fianza. Before the 90 days and revealed her dirty secret to the cameras, Jasmine admitted she had gotten an apartment in the same building as her ex-lover, Dane. The reality TV star didn't tell Gino the truth because that wouldn't have helped her. Therefore, she purposely lied until she couldn't keep it secret any longer. Jasmine had no sound justification for her actions and proceeded to hide the truth to the best of her abilities. She proved to the world that she wasn't a good human. One of Jasmine's biggest lies was about sleeping with Dane. Not only did she try to use him to make Gino jealous, but she also used him to get the upper hand in every situation. In one of the past episodes, Jasmine claimed she fantasized about Dane, which set Gino off. The mom of two didn't feel sorry about what she said and later claimed she lied about it to hurt Gino. It's hard to tell what Jasmine has been dishonest about as she always backtracks from her words. However, the 90 Day Fiancé star is a hypocrite for disrespecting Gino and expecting him to consider her superior to his family.